World Builder, and today we're gonna recap my past 24 hours that I spent live with you guys. So as per usual in World Builder fashion, I have a lot of impulsive ideas. And this one was starting a 24 hour live stream with a bit of a twist. Not only did I wanna stay up for 24 hours and get an insane amount of work done on my dream game, I wanted to give away 10,000 Robux every hour to other developers or teams chasing their dreams as well. So 24 hours and 240,000 Robux later, here we are. Tired? Maybe. Motivated? Oh yeah. And ready to elevate the videos and continue working hard to finish the game? Yes. Anyways, let's recap. At the start, everything was going great. Work was getting done, chilling was happening, and honestly, I was ready to tackle the 24 hours. As I started building and having a great time with you guys, the enemy of this stream would appear out of nowhere and kind of shut down my brain. Lack of planning. Yeah, the unspoken enemy to any builder. I guess going into a 24 hour lockdown game session with just a uh, working on your game isn't a great plan. I found out very quickly that going in blind with no reference photos and no set idea on this sort of work I wanted to really get done brought my workflow to a, a bit of a halt. However, this 24 hours was great for more than just the dream game, the other half of the stream, you know, the Robux. Thanks to my friend Hazem, we were able to give away 250,000 Robux total and help 25 developers and their teams. The winners were not all top of the line games because we wanted to make sure everyone got a chance. Some games were done, some games were just getting started, and some were just an idea. Needless to say, I think most of the stream was happy. Anyways, let's get into the actual amount of work I got done. 24 hours sounds like an insane amount of time. And you would think that working for 24 hours straight on any project, you would be able to finish the map or at least get close to it. But I have to be honest, over half of the stream, I was just sitting and talking with you guys. That leaves us with about 12.5 hours to work. And at the time, I was struggling to get good reference photos and definitely struggling on layout ideas. I guess what I'm trying to say is the amount of work I got done in 24 hours on stream, I could have gotten done in four hours off stream. Anyways, getting the prison tackled quickly became the goal of this stream and everything was going great. I'd say we got 80% of it built, but that's where we had to stop. Even after the stream and a couple hours of thinking, I still feel like I need to remake the prison building itself. Cause at the moment I have no clue how to fill in the rest of the space. I know what would go in there, maybe a shower spot, maybe a visitation booth, an office, but I have no idea how to fit them in the space that I've created for it. So at this moment, and maybe it's just the slight tiredness talking, I think we're gonna fully restart the prison building itself. Now I definitely plan to do more streams. Will they be 24 hours? Probably not. However, I think I could do one 24 hour stream every other month or even every month if you guys like them enough. I would say all in all, it was an awesome stream and I learned so much for how I can do it better next time. Anyways, it is a short video today because I want to go to sleep. Let me know if you guys prefer this style over the normal content better. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. Have a great day. Later.